Dum, da, da, dum, da, da, dum, da, dum. Welcome back. So previously we got into this and this is a confederated army and honestly it's just gonna get annihilated. So we're just gonna order resolve this because he's he's literally gonna just get bombed to oblivion, unfortunately for this guy. This is a confederated lord. He is 26, so we might be able to salvage him. See what his skills are like in a couple of turns. Goodbye, cruel world. It's unfortunate, but like I can't have armies absolutely everywhere. Like it might have been alright if it wasn't like loyal to zero and such a combat focused army, but I, I can't really just justify trying that mission really it's it's going to be such a grind this is shiny shiny under empire no, which is quite expansive so you know that's pretty good i do wish that uh, spawning armies was a bit more achievable it would uh, definitely be more interesting. Are they moving on there? Hmm, my allies, my allies are gonna get beat up pretty bad, aren't they? No, he's marching one army up to me on his own. Hmm, interesting. No, oh, it's. Oh, I thought it was going to bring more than one army in there. Man, is Clan Angwin, like, confederated someone else? Because it feels like he has a lot of armies spread around the map. Oh, look, they're coming back. They didn't like me winning that siege battle that turn. He's kind of massing around me. He's thinking about it. But he spread out a bit too much. Fighting the Wood Elves is uh, putting him in a bit of a detrimental situation to us. So hopefully we can resolve that. His empire is just, it's split in two, so he's having problems focusing. Probably explains why we survived. Because I don't know why he has all this land in the Badland. He must have confederated someone. Right? It's slightly weird that he does have all this land over here. And now to more dwarfs. No, not my other ally. Come on, Mass. Throw a scave and a bone. Just casually pans over the uh, massive force of undead that's just sat there. Wonder if I can bribe them to get onto my side. Did I enable diplomacy for Endgame Crisis Armies? Can you imagine? Just like bringing in all the Tomb King Legions as a new ally. <laughs> oh, that'd be great. And they're just there, you know. I don't think they have any territory is the problem, though. And kind of only enduring because they're Tomb Kings and don't cost anything. Alright, this... This is past the danger zone. Let's just, uh... Give a little... Little bump up. We don't need to watch 50 armies moving around. I do like to know where everyone's going, but there's there's limits. Limits to my patience. My infernal armory interest. Hello? Yes, yes. No, why do you want me to go to war with Britannia? It's like, hey man, do you want another war? I'm in enough wars, thanks. Mm. Imagine actually getting back to our turn. Imagine what that would be like. Oh, here we were speeding up a bit. There we go. 74 factions left. 
Oh, fair end. So, loyalty of one. I mean, it's only for 20 turns. Attrition. I guess we're going to take the attrition. This army... Oh, right. This is the garrison. And it survived. Somehow. A wizard would be good if we end up doing this again. But saying that, we only end up with 20 magic, don't we? So maybe not, actually. Hmm. Who would be the best to lead this force? The assassin's a very glass cannon. It would be nice to level some more. Let's get this guy and see what state he's in. Come on, get him to crash on me. No. Yeah, well, that's all everything there, so it doesn't really matter. We'll get an expansion -y thing. Uh, we really need a better system for this because this is what was that last bit yes I knew I did a lot of demolishing and construction Okay. I don't know why it's saying that. It seems a bit. Oh, because he's declared war on me. Strength rank one. As if I don't have enough people to fight, dude. Jesus. Jesus. All be slaves. Speak. Submit to your king. I do like you, Bony. I do like you. Let's, let's... Oops. Yeah, I gotta press the wrong thing. Sometimes I wish some things in this game would actually have a Are You Sure button. I will take them. I want to be a friend. Just for the irony point. And get all of the bad guys together. Mm, we're kind of a bit close though, I'm not sure if we'll get him on our side. Okay, wow, that's been, what, eight minutes? Alright. We have a lot. We don't quite have all of this. I do wonder, we should probably get one or the other, although we could probably just save it for nukes, realistically speaking, which we don't have any of now. That's not so great. How are we doing on the food front? Food is pretty reasonable. Stable, I believe, is probably the best way to put it. To be honest, I'm surprised it's taken this long for a scaven to declare war on me. All things considered. Alright, we got this army. Oh, we got these. We have got poison with mortar. So maybe... Maybe we do want to upgrade those guys then. No, they're not poison with mortar. They're Globideers. Right? Yes. Put your teeth back in there. So, bonus versus large. Missile strength. And armor piece. Well, we definitely want that one. Yeah, that one's kind of eh. So we'll just get those two for now, because I don't want to waste too much fuel. We are brave, my dear. This should be an easy fight. Take me, Bulbul! 
Yeah, there we go. Let's take it to the level. It all really matter. Just about pushing hard against these guys. Um, we need to get this like entire region on construction, I think, since this is our this is our safe space. So it will be once we finish clearing it out. All right, nice. So let's get everything upgraded. Okay, you, you've not yet got the discount. I could have sworn one of you guys already had a discount. Ah, it's up here, okay. Yes, yes. yes. <laughs> Everything. Very nice. Okay, so where are my lords over here? You're there, you are there. You're building them because, yeah, we said the problem was we were basically never waiting around to get any. Which is kind of infuriating, but that's fine. The army took no actual losses, that's good. Uh, you're okay, public order wise. These guys is yeah, slightly less, but we're building the control 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 buildings. Yeah, next turn we'll get a boost. And in a turn after that we'll get a boost. So yes, that should be good. I think we can hold out one turn, right? Yeah, there'll be a rebellion in four turns, but we're gonna get massively start off saying that. Soon soon. So you're going here. What's this guy's plan? This guy will yes go where he's needed. No, once we've taken these, we're not actually at war over here, so that's fine. Scroll was babysitting this being built up, but we don't really need to hold back, do we? Like we can we can easily scoot out just to see what's going on. Maybe maybe give him the bait. That's not my territory, is it? So yeah, we want to heal up. Make sure we've got plenty of range so we can attack, sack it, and then occupy and we'll start pushing into these guys. Okay, so who's actually my friends now? This is the boring part of the game, I guess. We have to do all the diplomacy rubbish. An allied mission no. is available. Is it though? Is it? Oh, it's because it's put me on the wrong thing. Against Grimgo. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure we even have the force over there to fight properly. This is going to get very messy very fast, but let's let's carry on. So that's that's all kind of positioned. Um, you guys are derping like hell. Corn has somehow lost Deadhead. Um, oh yeah, we pulled back. But we did screw him up royally. Who his boss is. Hmm. We still got most of units. We do, but we're taking a trash. Hmm. Unwise. Master assassin. I wonder what auto resolve will say. <laughs> yeah, he's got three units that aren't going to break and a bunch of other stuff. Yeah. 
It's not so strong that you can actually like, how far can you get? You can get just to there, so you can't actually attack the city. Is there anywhere I could actually move you couldn't reach? Oh, if only like I had this bit in my territory. We're just a bit too beat up. So we're gonna force march over here like that. So you can't actually reach the city, and then we're gonna get a wizard. Which will probably greatly help. Mm, we could get two actually. I don't particularly like these guys, but they're pretty reasonable. So we're going to use the warp shards. And he's kind of a throwaway combat character. And we can also get an engineer. Which will give us the chance to get more fuel. And on top of that, you know. do we have you before? Isn't it? Why do you get one point in that? Is that something that's normal? Am I losing my mind? Who knows? Find out next time. Okay, yeah, so we do that, and that way we'll be bumping the missile strength. And we can just merge one of these units up. So we're not actually losing any value from that army. So I guess... Right. Right. What is the deal with you guys? I can't... I can't talk to you. Ah, I should have enabled diplomacy with you guys. It's really gonna stink. Okay. Confident that this is probably just going to be a filler episode. We need to do something. That's ours, that's that. I mean, you could move down here, right? Because we are at war with that guy. I don't think you actually need to go home. Can we actually recruit you? We can. So we should probably get rid of the elite units we've got, right? Yeah, we definitely should. We recruit that stuff out of the city. Yeah, we can. Okay, cool. Let's go down here. Alright, yeah, you guys are major the troops. So that leaves us three spots. Uh, we've lost a bit of firepower. But ultimately, I'm not sure it matters. Maybe. Do we need anything fast? I don't think we need any walls. Let's get some stone them with shields to be more front line. So we've got it. We've got enough range to for this army for sure. So back in uh, Hellworld, aka many, many Elf. Sapping because you keep landing on these borders, buddy. And you're bringing an army over there as well. Just, just rude. It's extremely rude. Your army. It's a mix of stuff. Candidate for weapons testing. Well, <laughs> missile resistance, I guess, should no use to me if you're dead. And for you, my sir, let's make you even speedier. We could probably do with someone in here to tank. So, can we get any chieftains? We can. 
Get a warp stone order, which is probably going to be the best thematically. Now any other spaces with it? One more. Probably a backmaster. Mm -hmm. No, oh, that would be a nice buff for the army. Ashen contract approved. Okay, let's tell these people that actually go in the army. Right, okay, so Warlock, Master of Scrap. Mm, can we take these? I reckon we can. Yeah, yeah, that's more like it. Maybe I was reading that the wrong way around. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Right, we want to recruit because we can't be sitting around. What have we got on no this guy? Detected. He's got the weapons team's bonus, okay. Weapons teams it is then. Screw it, let's just go all in. Why not, eh? Okay. Warlock Master of Scryer. <laughs> They're actually chasing that army. Ah, uh, brave you are, Renessa Salzburg. Okay, well, Clan this is not ideal, but we're gonna Master Engineer. you two there, because that one can't run away. Master Engineer. Put you here. And we initialize. Horrific victory. Have you seen my fights, dude? Oh, it's not an ambush, is it? There we go. All right, we'll leave it there for this one. Slightly long and a bit of maintenance. Thank you very much for watching. If you are still watching, I hope to see you the next one, which will be in two days' time. And uh, I wish you good fortune in all your wars to come. Until then, bye-bye.